real quick just go ahead and comment below if you are looking like this right now while you're watching this video and if you don't comment i know you're lying Hey YouTube fam, welcome back to my channel. It's Alyssa Marie here, just in case you're new. Today we are getting into the perfect quarantine protective hairstyle, okay? Especially for those who are like me and don't know how to braid. I'm sorry, I'm working on it. I will get there one day. But until then, this twist is gonna be just fine. So today I'm gonna be going over exactly how I achieve this protective hairstyle as well as what I like to use in order to feed my curls some lovely nutrients and goodness so that by the time I take these out in like the next few days, weeks, months, whatever, we'll be popping. So if you're interested in seeing all of that, then just continue to watch. All right, so let's just jump straight in. This is actually one of my favorite protective styles to do. This is like the perfect protective styling for right now when we are stuck at home in quarantine. All right, so I'm just gonna start by taking out my pineapple. For this style, you kind of want to start with hair that's like fully detangled. And in order to detangle my hair, it needs to be very, very damp. So I'm just going to go in with my DIY spray. This is a mixture of water and conditioner. The conditioner that I have in here right now is the Maui Moisture Awapui Conditioner. I just put like literally a little squirt, add water, and then just mix it up. And then it'll look something like this. So just starting by dampening my entire head to try and make this as easy to detangle as possible. All right, so we're nice and damp now. And next I'm gonna grab my Maui Moisture Combing Cream to again help with the detangling process. All right, and then next I'm gonna go ahead and divide my hair into two sections. You don't have to worry too much about how the part looks in the back. Again, because we stuck at home, ain't nobody cares. But you might, just in case you wanna take selfies or something, you might just wanna make sure just at least the front here is nice and straight. So I am just grabbing my rat tail comb to part. And then for the back, I'm just using my fingers. So I've gone ahead and clipped up one side because it's definitely much easier to deal with one side at a time. Just gonna put in a little additional combing cream. And then next I'm just gonna grab this brush by Brush With The Best, which is this brand new detangling brush which is meant to make detangling so much easier. So this is actually my first time using it, so let's see how it goes. I am feeling this brush, okay? Look at how quickly that detangled all of this and it's not even like wet, it's only damp. I was expecting to struggle a little bit and it also didn't feel like it was tugging my hair as much as the Denman brush did. Like, it seems very, very just light and like gentle but nice, like it gets the job done. I love it. I also love the size, it's pretty big. All right, and then next I'm just gonna go ahead and grab my Camille Rose Coconut Water Leave-In Detangling Hair Treatment. I love to use this as like a little lightweight, simple leave-in treatment. And because I'm planning on doing this protective style and then just leaving it for the next few days, it is actually just gonna sit in there and just give your hair just so much moisture and love. It is so perfect and it's not as intense as a deep conditioner, so you don't have to worry about overdoing it as well. So this can actually be used as a leave-in conditioner, but whenever I wanna use it as a leave-in treatment, I just go ahead and use a little bit of additional product. I like to focus a lot of product right here because I do have like a dry patch in the middle of my head, so I'm making sure to get a lot of product in that area. So next I'm just gonna grab this smoothing brush and kind of just brush down the front of my hair just to make sure that the front is like nice and neat. I really don't care about how the back looks, but the front gotta look cute. All right, and then I'm just gonna go ahead and twist it. So I literally don't know how to braid, so twisting is definitely my go-to and it is so, so easy. So all you have to do is grab two strands of hair and then twist it as normal. The only thing different is that you're continuing to grab additional hair as you're going along. And just a little tip, in terms of your twist, you're gonna wanna twist it down under, so towards your face. It is so, so much easier and less complicated than a braid.
at the base of the twist I always like to secure it because a twist is not as tight as a plait is so I like to just grab a hair tie and just secure it right here So that's it for one side. I'm gonna go ahead and recreate the other side. So this is the final look. So cute and comfortable. Honestly, I feel like this style takes about 10 years off my life. Like I feel like I'm looking 15 years old all over again, but it's fine, it's fine because we're all stuck at home. And honestly, this treatment is so bomb that I know by the time I take this out in the next couple of days, whoo, she gonna be soft and moisturized and nice, honey. I really hope you guys found this useful. If you did, go ahead and give your girl a thumbs up. And also comment below if you are going to be taking care of your curls all quarantine long. Okay, this is like the perfect time to do it. Thanks so much for watching, guys. But before you leave, two more videos right here. Just binge, it's fine. I'll catch you on the next one. Bye.